Good morning, boys and girls. Here's our story for today. So take a look at the cover and the picture. What do you see? I see that same animal from yesterday. What is that animal we were talking about for this holiday? This story is called One Little, Two Little, Three Little Pilgrims. So these are pilgrims. Look at the way that they're dressed. They have on a lot of different kinds of clothing and they have different kind of clothing. These are the indigenous people. So these are indigenous people, the Native Americans, and these are the pilgrims. One little, two little, three little pilgrims. What does he see? What does this boy see coming in the water? What is that? One little, two little, three little pilgrims. So I see one, two, three pilgrims. That's what they're called, these people. And they're all doing something very important. Four little, five little, six little pilgrims. Seven little, eight little, nine little pilgrims, 10 pilgrim boys and girls. Let's count together. How many pilgrims do we see on this page? So how many people? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten pilgrim boys and girls. What is this pilgrim doing? This is their little town, right? We're learning about the community that we live in, and this is their community. This is their town that they live in. Now we are looking at the Native Americans. One little, two little, three little Wampanoag. And Wampanoag is the name of um, their tribe. So when you call someone by their tribe name, it's kind of like calling them by their last name and everybody has a last name. So Miss Angela is what you call me, but my last name is Casal. So that would be my tribe name. Four little, five little, six little Wampanoag. Seven little, eight little, nine little Wampanoag. Ten little Wampanoag boys and girls. So look at the indigenous people. Look at their town. Their little community is different than the pilgrims. So how many Native American people do you see on this page? Can you count them? Where are they? I see sand and I see water. Where are they? What are they doing? Digging for clams, fishing for cod. So they're looking for food. Hunting for ducks, rabbit, and geese. Now the weather has changed. What kind of weather are they having? What is coming down from the sky? Now it's cold, so what is happening to the weather? Planting crops of corn and beans. Everyone has a job to do. So the pilgrims and the Native Americans are all doing a job.
digging for turnips, carrots, and beets. So now they're in the garden. Gathering nuts, berries, and squash. So they come from different communities, but they're all doing the same thing. They're gathering food. Carrying baskets of barley and corn. Now it's time to celebrate. So look at these people and these people. What do you think they're going to do? It says now it's time to celebrate. Do you think they're going to celebrate the Thanksgiving holiday? One big, two big, three big turkeys. Four big, five big, six big turkeys. Seven big, eight big, nine big turkeys. Ten big turkeys for the feast. Uh-oh, what are they going to do with the turkeys? Turkey, cornbread, cranberry stuffing, pumpkin, cider, Indian pudding, clams and oysters, tummies growling. So look, they made the turkey. This is part of their Thanksgiving feast. And I see something yummy, a yummy treat here. They have some pie. Let's give thanks and then we will eat. So when we give thanks, it means that we are thankful and grateful and we really appreciate the people and the things that we have. So they are very happy and they're saying thank you to everyone, right? And they feel very lucky. The end. And it says, Happy Thanksgiving.